hello. Uh, I didn't even remember I wrote that. That's, that's, really, that's really my dream. It's a nice dream. Um, so let's talk about something else. Um, there is this girl that I know, and her name is Tanya. Talia Lehman. You know she's 10. She's living in Iowa, in a little town, and she's there, sits in her coach, and she's watching television. And it's 6 o'clock p.m., and she's watching the news, and she's watching a clip of the city of New Orleans after the Katrina hurricane. And she's overwhelmed by what she sees, and she decides she must do something, but she's 10. She's 10 years old. She, hasn't, she doesn't have a credit card. She doesn't have a driving license either. So she decides to collect her friends in the area, and they do some kind of fundraising action in Halloween. They go door to door with the masks and the candies, and they ask for the money, but the money is not for them. The money is for the city of New Orleans. And the action captures the attention of the media. And she is invited to speak in a program, in a morning program at NBC called Today. She goes to Today, she explains her plans, and she collects $10 million for the cities of New Orleans. So, strong for this success and confident in herself, she decides, and she's now 11, to do something more. And she creates a platform in the internet called Random Kid, Dot org, where every kid can become a social entrepreneur. In that page, 12 million kids, small kids, in 20 countries in the world are collaborating in things like building a school in Cambodia, helping build an hospital, pay a pump of water, creating medical care where, where this doesn't exist, and many other things. Now she's 16. She has been an entrepreneur, a social entrepreneur for the last six years, and she's with us. Now, let's go back to Spain. Let's go to Zaragoza. Alejandro, a very young man, for the last 10 years in his platform called Ilogica, he's helping children in distress, and he is with us. Burgos, Simon Menendez. He has created a foundation, a very young man, he has created a foundation called Asociación Hechos. From there, he helps kids, immigrant kids, that came from Africa, probably by themselves, to learn the profession, to learn to be citizens. And he is with us. Uh, Inigo Blanco from Bilbao, he is a designer, he loves design. He's a very young designer, so he thinks design is a tool for social improvement, design thinking for social improvement, and he is with us. Wahan, a girl, a Moroccan girl, 17 years old, she now lives in the hospitalet, and she's helping hospitalet.